Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead God Plus series. We are jumping in again on a nice little four streak. Taken Forgotten, we've done a lot. Mastema, I've done two. I, I want to go for someone we haven't done yet and god damn it, we got one. We got someone I haven't done yet. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. This guy, I kind of love him, but he's a bit thingy. I do think, by the way, that the issues with... Um, but it's Minora when you get hit. I can never remember. The issue with the planetarium item rerolls should be fixed now. This will be a great test of that. Otherwise, we are locked into some planetarium action here. Uh, so we'll see how this goes. I can't remember what this card does. I love the uh, the floor sprites of this. For one minute, okay, let's just pop it. Like it's it's fine. I just kind of want the tears. Yeah, um, I can never remember how the fire works, but if it's on hit. It's terrible. <laughs> it does nothing for us. Um, I do need to update my mod that removes certain items from uh, playing as Tainted Eden. Because I believe it's like hella out of date and doesn't actually function as it should right now. So I need to tweak that and, uh, and, and fix that at some point. So I'll look into that. And also obviously adding modded items to that excluded list as well. But let's just try and not get hit. We've started out with not so great stats. Our damage is okay. I will take a pill. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. The Mitre, honestly, considering we can't get anything else, let's just take it and hope we get a good few soul hearts before. By the way, I never remember, does, does How to Jump let you um, get into care rooms for free? It doesn't, does it? I'm fairly sure it doesn't. Right. You're taken care of. Oh, I was like, ooh, I can jump over and get that. And it's like, no, it's a troll bomb. Okay, this is eternal for you, so I'm going to... Pop a bomb down just to basically half the length of this fight. Oh, our tears just ran out as well. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, I do remember that his bouncy around the room this attack is significantly longer than his vanilla counterpart. So, let's just be ready for that. Yeah, there you go. And then this does three strikes too. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. I actually can't believe it. I think my menorah did a little bit of extra damage there as well. Oh, God. How am I not getting hit right now? I am so, so confused. Um, ooh, squeezy is very nice. That gives us some soul hearts. And we got a double soul heart out of that as well. Booyah, baby. Let's go and get that red heart real quicky dicky. Boom. Good, good. This is not a bad start. Not a bad start. How to jumps, just kind of okay. But yes, there is a bug. That may happen where all of our items get rerolled into planetarium items. It has been said to be fixed. So we will see. In terms of question of the day, and probably we're going to find out about that now. In terms of question of the day, what is the worst meal you've ever eaten? <clears throat> Someone asked this uh, to me on my Discord and I liked the idea of the question. For me, it's, it's a toss-up. There's a few different things. In terms of, like, items of food... Like, if it's like a single thing, it's probably something seafood related, like squid or something. But if it's in terms of an actual meal that I remember, then it's probably one of two. Either one time when my mum made, um, she made a vegetarian lasagna. And it was the most disgusting thing I've ever tasted in my life. And bear in mind, my mum is a very good cook. Like, my mum's cooking is fantastic. It was just the ingredients. It was like eggplant and stuff. And oh my god, it was it was just awful. I hated it so much. You know what? I'll take that. That could actually be useful right now. <clears throat> I absolutely hated it. It was absolutely awful. Or oh, second, <clears throat> this one is a little uh, a little funnier than than the food just being not enjoyable. Ooh, um, I'm gonna take the twins instead. The twins is potentially better. We don't have a key yet. Damn. One minute. I need to clear my throat. One second. I've just eaten a meal, sir. So, um, I had. Bur a burger and a chicken breast. I, well, but it wasn't it wasn't a burger with a bun. It was just a burger on its own. So I'm trying to lose weight. Anyways, but yes, it was it was something my dad made. Made my dad is not a terrible cook, but he doesn't cook often. So he like if he's making something from scratch, it's not exactly his. Oh god, god damn it! Ah, it's still broken. It's still broken. Oopsie daisy. Right. <clears throat> One moment. Okay, I'm back again. We have seen enough of that bug for now. I'm going to have to alert the developers. But we're just going to roll it back again and play as normal Lilith here. Yeah, I just... 
runs with that bug currently are incredibly samey, obviously. So, um, yeah, I, I, I don't want to have to go through that again. But we are playing the custom version of Lilith using the mod that um, I had the idea for and Preden uh, was nice enough to create. Incubus will adopt any of our tier effects and we start with the child's leash. Makes this character just actually playable um, because in her base form she is not. But anyways, what was I saying? Yeah, the other one is an actual meal that was made. My dad isn't a terrible cook. He uh, he doesn't cook very often, like homemade stuff, but like when he does like a fry up or anything like that, they're absolutely incredible. But one time he tried to make pie. Do you know what? This is a room that, that needs this. There's a lot going on in here. Uh, one time he tried to make pie from scratch, making the pastry and all, which is generally not, a, it's, it's not an easy task, but it's not a super difficult one either. It's not like a, a really hard meal to make, but I wouldn't exactly classify it as like beginner cooking. Um, and he uh, he made it and he it looked fine. It cooked well, it, it, it seemed great, but then we took our first bite and um, he'd forgotten a fairly crucial ingredient in the pastry making process. And uh, that ingredient was water. He didn't add any water during the creation of the pastry, which meant the very moment you put the pastry in your mouth, it just exploded into just this powdery, bitty mess. And it was just disgusting. Like, the taste wasn't particularly bad, although it wasn't great. It wasn't particularly bad, but the texture was awful. It was literally like biting into, like, chalk. Oh, it was... I remember, I still remember it. It was absolutely awful. It scarred me a little bit. And yeah, he, ne he safe to say he never made pie again. Um, <laughs> yeah, he was just like, oh, I didn't think the water would be that important. It's like, bloody hell. You can't not put water in it. It won't work if you don't. So yeah, it was, uh, it was pretty awful. Um, and then other than that, in terms of other like single item things that have been just terribly horrible that I've eaten. Ooh, we get the back bombs. Nice. Um, another one is probably when I accidentally... So I, I opened a, a yogurt and I didn't really consider the fact that the yogurt might not be the freshest. So I opened it and without looking, I took a bite. And you might already be able to see where this is going. I, uh, I took a big old spoonful and just ate it without thinking, without looking. And it was incredibly moldy. Um, essentially, I just got an, a mouthful of a thick layer of fairy mold, and it, it it made me throw up almost instantly. It was it was absolutely horrible. Okay, this is kind of a tough little room here. Yeah, it was it was it was horrible. It, it, yeah, it made me gag and not quite throw up, but pretty much throw up instantly. I was spew, spewed up a little bit. It was bad. Oh, compound fracture. Hell yes. Now all of our familiars gain compound fracture now. That's pretty awesome. So obviously at the minute we don't have any other familiars. Although, does my mini Isaac adopt that? I don't actually know. That's that's a that's a question that I have. And we got spirit shackles here as well, which is not amazing, but I'll take it. I'm going to do all of these. Sometimes you can get some good stuff. You see? And then we can also do a bomb there as well. Let's keep her going. Okay. Let's go through. Pop this. We do have an eternal version of this guy. But we do have a ton of bath bombs. So, fear not. And then here we get placenta. That's pretty good going. Okay. Down to the next floor. Um, no, we've only got one key. I'll go normal path for now. We need to do a few more mother runs soon. But the mother runs are kind of difficult because you only get like one completion mark for doing a mother run or two. I think you get Isaac, the Isaac's heart completion mark as well. But yeah, it's not, it's not as many as you could get on other runs. So it's not a priority run for me. Yeah, let's keep her going. But yeah, apologies about the uh, the Tainted Eden run. It, it the, the developers are working to try and fix it. They are, but it's it's clearly not a simple issue. It's clearly something that's causing uh, 
causing some serious problems. And it seems to be fixed on their end, but not mine. So it might be some mod conflict or something. Because I definitely have the most up-to-date version of, the, of their Ipecac. It's a bit strange. Ow, that was a bad hit. This is kind of just a, a generally kind of hard room. I'm, I'm glad I have compound fracture for it, I'll be honest. But today, I've been feeling really nice and chilled out today. I've had a good day. I woke up and I woke up really tired, actually. I think it's because I had caffeine the other day. I've been I've been laying off caffeine. I think I've to told you guys that I've been kind of taking a break from caffeine recently. But I had some uh, a few days ago, like two days ago now, just because I, well, it was because there was a new energy drink flavor. Simple as. I, Katie brought me at home and I was like, damn, that looks good. I'm going to have it. Um... And so I did, and I kind of regret it, because like for, for, for the past two or three days after having it, I've been feeling really tired when waking up, which I haven't been for a good while now, so a bit of a mistake on my part, but eh, kind of worth it. Uh, right, let's pop this bad boy. Yeah, so, um, so I woke up kind of tired this morning, and I was just kind of like, I've been trying to go to the gym every morning, not, not for like any big sesh or anything, I literally just go and like put, put the, uh, put the treadmill on the steepest incline possible, and then just do like a walk for like... 30 to 40 minutes, um, and bear, it burns like two or 300 calories, so it's like a, just a good way to start the day. Also, it kind of wakes me up as well, so it's kind of nice. Um, but I couldn't really go this morning, I was just a bit too, a bit too tired. So I was a bit disappointed in myself, but I kind of felt a little bit better later in the day, and then I kind of obviously just did work throughout the day. I, I played some Call of Duty with my friend um, in the middle of the day, because just had time during our, uh, our lunch break, kind of lined up nicely, so we played some COD. Um, and did decently well. And then, um, yeah, I just kind of got on with the rest of my day. It wasn't anything special. Nothing nothing interesting happened, really. It was just more of uh, more of the same. But then uh, I decided to go to the gym after I'd finished work. And goddamn, I'm so glad I did. After I went to the gym, I, like, got back and got a shower and stuff. And I just, I've just, ever since then, I've just felt so relaxed. Something I've been doing recently, actually, just because I saw a video about it. it like, it's not something I've ever considered before. One moment. Yeah, it's not something I've ever considered before, but um, I saw a I saw a video about how cold showers are like much better for your body. They're like healthier, um, and it seemed like reasonable. Like like the video didn't seem like bullshit. It seemed to be someone that was qualified to talk about it. Obviously, you never really know unless I, unless you do your uh, research. But the guy seemed reasonably qualified to talk about it and seemed to know what he was talking about. And it seemed like it seemed pretty valid. So. I gave it a go, and I've been I've been doing it now for like uh, damage every time I get hit. Unfortunately, not really what we're looking for, but I'll take it. Um, yeah, I've been doing it for like two weeks now, and I, I'm actually really enjoying it. Like the very first moment of getting into the shower is a little painful, um, just because you are absolutely freezing cold, and it takes your sec takes your body a second to get used to it. But once you get used to it, after that first like two or three seconds, you're you're completely fine. It doesn't matter at all. Um, and yeah, I've been I've been thoroughly and enjoying it. I, I feel like I get out of the shower more often, feeling a lot more relaxed. Um, hello, Juki. Juki, baby. Ooh, that was not what I intended, but it works. It worked, it works. Uh, Devil Deal? Yes. Eye of the Occult? Yes. This is a gamble and a half, this is. Ah, oh, you bastard. I gambled hard on that, and I'm so upset. So I gambled on that, thinking, hey, it'll adopt my tier effects, and it doesn't. <laughs> Little bit upsetting. But it should still double, though. It should still double with the box. But now, the, the real gamble part of this is, is there a soul heart in here? There's a bed. That's actually much better. <laughs> That's significantly better than I was expecting. Okay, so that wasn't anywhere near as much of a gamble. I essentially got it for free. Um, that's good. I would very much like the blue map here, so... Let's, uh, let's play what we can to get ourselves a penny. There's a room full of fires over here, so... That's our way in. Just because we've got bombs, we can find secret rooms relatively easy here. There you go, look. Easy. Done. First fire, easy bangers, easy bangers. All right, let's keep it going. Yeah, I was hoping this guy would get uh, compound fracture tears, but sadly not. But yeah, still, I'm pretty happy with this. We got this going on. Now we can find our secret rooms easily. This is a rather annoying secret room to find for me, though. I'm really bad at finding the uh, 
finding the L-shaped ones. Is it here? No. <laughs> I've just... I don't... I don't... Where's the door meant to be? Is it here? There you go. Ugh. Oh, useless to me. And then this... This one's a, a real shot in the dark. Good enough. A two of clubs, ace of hearts. I'm just going to pop the two of clubs now. And we don't need the world card anymore, really. I'm just going to take the ace of hearts. It's an ace of hearts. Do, 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 do. So, yeah. Feeling nice and chilled out today. My muscles feel relaxed. I'm good to go. I'm glad that my gamble paid off because that was... I was a little scared. I was a little scared. Right, but this this dude should double whenever we double. I, I will try that soon. I don't actually know if he will. Maybe he doesn't count as a familiar, and that's why the uh, tier effects don't work with him. I don't know. Best friend. I'm sorry, but not quite what we need right now. We gulped. Ah, we gulped Child's, uh, Child's necklace there. That's kind of nice. Full health doesn't really do anything for us. Tears down. That does a lot for us in a sad way. I give some damage for the floor. Why not? Okay. Bit sad on that there. It's okay. We'll keep moving. I'm loving compound fracture with... Ooh, a dime. I'm loving compound fracture with... Uh, Eye of the Occult, by the way, because it means that all the fragments are, are, like, hitting the same enemy. They, like, fly the way that we're shooting. Makes it much better. Um, To spawn a damaging fire upon killing enemy. Yeah, you go. That's pretty good going. I like that. Ooh, baby. I love your way. Okay, I would like to grab that. I don't know if we're going to be able to afford it. But there's a chance. We don't have our donation machine to rely on, so that's a thing. But we, we might be able to eke our way into that. We'll see. Okay. Just wanted to make sure they were all off of the thingy. Oh, increased chance for tinted rocks. That would also be very good. Sadly, this was all red hearts. I was hoping we'd get something uh, more useful out of that, like a single soul heart. Usually they're good for at least one. There's a penny. We're getting closer. There's another penny. Wow, what a deal. What a deal. Yeah, it definitely duplicates the heart. Nice. That's actually pretty useful. That's going to be a lot of tears on screen here. It's just a shame they don't adopt our tier effects. It must be because it's a modded familiar and it's like hard-coded which familiars it works with. Either that or the way that it fires is just not handled the same way that most familiars fire. I don't actually know. I, I, I kind of highly doubt it's a hard-coded list. That seems excessive and time-consuming, and I don't know why Priam would do that, but they might have done. I don't know. I don't judge. Priam can let you know in the comments if they're watching. Stay away from me, you dookie fella. Oh, we got, uh, Mini Isaac's still alive. Mini Isaac, are you firing compound fracture tears? You are. He is. That's beautiful. <laughs> what a little legend. What a little legend. I'm going to check out my shop here, just because I might be able to blow up my, uh, blow up my dude and get some pennies. Oh, wait, he died. <laughs> Ooh, what the hell's this? Nothing of value, really. Damn, okay. It's looking like we're not gonna quite make it. We're not gonna quite make it to Golden Champion Belt. That's fine. It is a very good item, so I, un I un is understand why it costs 30. It kind of should. It is, in it is incredibly good. 
God damn, these fires are so good on enemies that like split into other enemies. Beautiful. The sack could be good. Oh, we need flight so badly here. We've not found any temporary flight or anything either. It's a little bit upsetting. Okay, got a key. This little sack here could be just what we're looking for. Eh, it was close. Right, so, now we have a different option. A slightly tweaked alter alternate reality here. So before, we would have been getting the Golden Champion Belt. But now, we could be getting so much more. Yes. For one, he's a familiar, but for two, he's a revive. And, yeah, he works. He works with Eye of the Occult. I think he'll also work with Compound Fracture. Yes, he does. Which means we should get a lot of money, because Compound Fracture, uh, like, plus Penny Tears, is going to mean a lot for us. Also, interestingly enough, it seems that the, the heart is kind of like King Baby. It now directs where our other familiars go. Which is good because we have Eye of the Occult. This is this is good. This is some good stuff. Salsa. I do just want to try something real quick. If I were to bomb this, would it refill the shop with another item? No, it would not. Good to know. I will take this card. King of Diamonds. Lose everything and get something. Is that... Lose all of our money and get stuff based on how many coins we lose. Let's see what happens if we lose a single penny. <laughs> Nothing. I kind of thought as much. But we now have some familiars that are working together with our effects, which I'm very happy about. And obviously we have a revive. That's a dunce cap right there. I think dunce cap with Eye of the Occult is pretty good. So I'm going to need you to make your way over here. Dude. Dude. <laughs> There you go. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Please say I can pick this up. Yes, I can. Okay, so. Yes, there you go. Okay. With Ivy Occult, Dunce Cap is basically just 2020. Now, you may be noticing there is some lag. That's just because there's a lot of tears on screen. Ignore the lag. The lag is none of your concern. Ah, that was close. We do have to keep tap firing to make sure our, our, our fellas are following us. Because they're now following the heart. I, I'm, I'm unsure, I'm unsure if that is intentional design for the heart or unfortunately bad coding. Uh, I'm going to go and check. I feel like it is unfortunate coding, but you, you never know, you never know. Effects. Synergies. It doesn't say anything about it, so I think it's just the way it's coded. I don't think it's meant to do that. But I kind of like it. Reels are all pickups, hell yes. We got a soul heart out of it. Ooh, the lighter looks really good. Although, we've got two different fire-based trinkets as options, and I'm, I'm sorry, but the one that we're holding right now is much more appealing to me, despite it being an on-death effect. One helps us kill the initial enemies, another helps us kill the future enemies. Nah, I, I like I like what we've got going on. We've not had a single penny yet, which is surprising. I was just about to say, watch us get one while it's over a gap. I'm finding it a little difficult to see my tears in this uh, situation because our things are purple. The background's blue. I'm kind of losing them a little bit. I feel like we're on the way to the boss here. One thing about having um, the whiz shot, it does mean that we're firing slightly ajar. Like we're kind of firing to the left and right a little bit rather than uh, like straight up. My lord. Look at the... Look at the tears go. 
I forgot that um, Ivy Occult gives you Spectral. The Burn Fragments. They're coming for you. Ow. I just stood there and watched that hit me, didn't I? Sad to say, we've got blue map, but no mapping. That is quite de depressy spaghetti, if I had to say so myself. Okay. Still not a single penny out of you. Oh, this was the way to the shop, not the boss. Oh, what the hell's that dude doing alive? That Lovecraftian horror. Keep it away from me. It disturbs me in my sleep. Oh, this, this room can actually go and suck a fart. This room is such a huge pain in the ass. It's good when we can angle our tears the correct way, though. Okay, you two are doing your thing. Easy. We've got good range as well right now, so it's just chunking through. Just absolutely chunking through. But yeah, on the topics of bad food, well, kind of on the topic of bad food, the tea I had today was great. <laughs> it wasn't bad at all. It was very nice. I've been, um, I, I, as, you, as a lot of you probably know, I really like cooking. I've been doing a little bit more sort of, I wouldn't say experimenting recently, but I've been trying some new things here and there. Um, my my mum bought me a stand mixer the other day, so I've uh, I've been sort of playing around with that. I really want to make some like nice burger buns and do smash burgers. That's what I made today, actually. I made smash burgers, but I didn't have them with bread just to, to lower my calories and carbs and stuff. Um, but that is something that I would like to do. You are dead, or at least one half of you is dead. Beautiful. Brimstone me, I dare you. I can angle my shots, you son of a bitch. Ooh, hello. Fear shot for my babies. Oh, everything is, it's all coming together now. And it's nice to have them not be purple now. Oh no, amnesia. What am I going to do? Now, does anyone remember if I got dunce cap on this floor or not? Because I don't. I'm pretty sure I did. But I'm going to have to go back and check just to make sure. But yeah, like today I made uh, I made smash burgers, but instead of having it in a bun, I did them in like little lettuce wraps. They were really good. They were really good. And I had a, I had a chicken breast as well. It was top tier. Tell you what, you have not tasted properly cooked chicken and bacon and even beef anything and meat in general until you've had it cooked on a cast iron skillet. God damn, it makes a difference. One of the best things I've ever been bought. It is it is truly legendary. I like now that I've got it, I can't believe I went so long without one. <laughs> I use it literally daily. Um before I used to use like a non-stick pan and it's just like it's just not the same. Just you just don't get the same results. Okay, yeah, we definitely have. This was th this was the dunce cap floor. I thought so, because I saw the salsa, and it's like the salsa's a boss item, so. Unless last floor I got the boss item and then the item room, which I very rarely do. That wouldn't be the case. But I had to reassure myself every single time this happens. It's why I, it's why I hate this curse. Because I'm so forgetful. I just can't comprehend where I've been and where I've gone. Right. We are at the boss now, though. We can hop down to the next floor. Ah. <sighs> I've got some sparkling le lemon and um, lime water. It is very pleasant. Ooh, the D20. It, it would be it would be good if I could take it, but I can't. By the way, I have heard people asking, why don't I just get the mod that makes it so that you can um, carry two actives? Like, you can have the box of friends as her pocket active. And it's just like... Yeah, I I do kind of agree that, like, it wouldn't make her too much more powerful also. S someone remove these demon horrors from my game. Please. Please. It's hit me three times. Who is it that's doing this? Reveal yourself. But, yeah, um, I realize it's not, like, crazy powerful or anything. I, I should, like, be fine with it. But, I don't know. It's just... 
it feels like it'd make the character a, a bit too easy. Um, and she's not exactly a super hard character as it is, or a super easy character, but I don't know. I kind of like it the way it is. There's, there's a reason I don't use it. I, I can't exactly give you that reason, but there is a reason. <laughs> I can't be precise with the reasoning, but it is there. We need, to, we need to hop over the fence, don't we? This guy is feared and just not getting anywhere close to us. There you go. Okay, let's find our secret rooms here. Oh, hello. You're still about. Don't think so, Malada. Not Maladin. I can get both here if I do this right. Ooh, another. This is this is kind of peculiar, really. This is another shop within a secret room. And there you go. For our troubles, we get Sausig. Very, very nice. The fire rate especially. We needed that after that tears down. It has helped me regain my confidence. Ooh, what does an eternal version of this guy do? Apparently he sits there and dies and tries nothing at all to escape. Guppy's head. A red heart. Big sad. Okay, we do have a, a health sharing dude over here. Let's try and kill him first, shall we? There you go. That was just dumb. I moved in such a bad way there. Oh my god, the lag is a bit real here. Shooting definitely caused some issues. You can see there's like absolutely no lag when we're not shooting. But when we start shooting, things get a little out of hand. Now, duct tape. Duct tape's interesting. Now, I kind of like that. I got hit immediately there by something, and I'm not sure what it was. Okay, yeah, duct tape here is, uh, is very nice. It allows us to do a much more focused stream. Whoa! Okay, duct tape plus that heart. I don't know. It, it did not like that. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yeah, I really like this duct tape setup. Very nice. I like the fact that when we uh, when we use our space bar as well, our box of friends, it, it, it stays in the duct tape formation that we've uh, set up for ourselves. I like having fear on this guy because he just never charges you. This item needs a nerf, by the way. I, I It's from a new mod. It's called like bits and pieces or odds and ends, I think. I can't remember exactly what it's called. But yeah, it's it's strong. Um... Do, 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 do. Some good stuff here. I think I'm taking all of it. I, I want to take nine lives, even though it's a little risky, just because we are one-off guppy now. <clears throat> Does put us in a slightly precarious spot right now, though. But yeah. So, Gusty Blood is going to give us a tears up on kill. And on kill, the Apology is going to give us a bunch more tears that fades quickly. And by fades quickly, it means very, very slowly. <laughs> I think the idea for the item's great, but it should fade over the course of maybe half a second. Maybe a full second if you've been generous, but it seems to fade over the course of about five seconds. Maybe a little longer even. It ends up being a very powerful boss item. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this. Oh my god. The hearts do not like this duct tape thing. Because it's like, when I hold, they stick around. But then it's like, as soon as I let go, it insta-teleports to my location. 
And sometimes it gets a little, a wee bit confused about where that might be. Bob's Curse. We're getting a lot of items from secret rooms here. I know that wasn't a secret room item, but... You, you dig me. You get me. Pow, pow, pow. I love the amount of speed that we've gained. Or that we're gaining per room, should I say. Oh, yes, he's back. My boy. My hero. Oh, yes, we've got enough power to kill him. Look at this just wall of shots. Do you think you can really make it through? Is this room in the shape of a skull as well? I think it is, isn't it? I don't know how to get to this uh, second secret room here. It seems like off of the beaten path. We are on Necro 2, okay. I think I've got to go all the way up around to the right. We've still got to find our item room as well here, so I don't mind backtracking a bit. Okay. Left hand is unfortunately not duct tape, so I'll have to let you go. I would maybe take Forgotten Lullaby over this, but it, it would take a lot. I really like this setup. I think this might even be better than Forgotten Lullaby. Okay, can't get that spiked rock anyways. Ah! Big oof. Shop, we might as well check. Some pennies here. Not worth all too much to us. Okay, second secret room. We finally made it. A long away to journey. Okay, fear shot here is proving to be very nice. There you go. Kind of like the bath bombs. They're pretty cool. Okay. Sadly, that bed's useless to us. And let's make our way. Let's make our way. Item room is... Yeah, item room's still up for grabs. I don't know why, but I feel I feel some good feelings about that. And unfortunately, it gave us a host. Oh, my lord. Come on, item room. Be good to us. That is good to us. That mum's perfume is something you always want to see. Oh, tinted rock as well? Hell yes. Glad I stuck around. Okay. Things are in a decent spot now. Things are in a decent spot. But yes, anyways, regardless of the game, how has people been recently? How, what's the happenings? How are people going? What say you? Temperance? We can use the temperance aggressively, so why not? Can we make boss rush here? Oh, no, 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 we cannot. I need to pay more attention to that. I've been playing like a slow bro. But yeah, how has everyone been? Is everyone doing well mentally in school and their job? How is it all going? It's always good to hear. Uh, yeah, we'll take Polaroid. I know Rotten Baby isn't going to adapt our tier effects, but still. Okay, I just need to drop duct tape a minute here. Wait, I need to... I need to drop it here. This is kind of difficult. Is that right? That's good enough. That's good enough. Right, down we go. Okay. A bit confused on where to go here. This way clearly wasn't correct. Ooh. Eternal versions of this guy. Hell no. Hey, I think we opened that uh, thingy room there. Nice. Ooh, hello. I will take a soul of Isaac, most definitely. 
Okay, I'm going to try this way. Oh my god. The game has double trolled me. The game has double trolled me. Secret room's below, and I was like, okay, I'll go over that way then. It's like, soik. Not really, you jabroni. Oh shit, there's, there's uh, tears there that I thought were mine. Even though they obviously aren't. Okay, so we might lose a nine life or two. We might lose one or two of our nine lives is probably the better way to word that sentence. But I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be just about okay. Oh, but yeah, th this weekend got a lot going on. Kind of a lot going on. Um, it's the Queen's Jubilee on Thursday and Friday. In, in like, So everyone gets a day off. I don't give two flying shits about... Um, I'll come back for you. I don't give two flying shits about the Queen's Jubilee. Um, I mean, the royals, who, who could... Who cares less? Like, I don't care at all. Um, but it means I get two days off, which is nice. So I get like an extended weekend. And then my girlfriend's parents are coming over uh, because it's her mum's birthday. Um, and we're going to go out quad biking and axe throwing. We found like a little activities place and it sounds really interesting. I'm also going to the theatre um, on Saturday to see the play that all went wrong, which I, I, I've, I haven't been to the theatre since I was like six. So I have absolutely no idea what it's going to be like or what it's about. I've just said yes because my friends are going. Uh, and also we're going to a, um, like a barbecue house before for food. And we, I've been there before. It is quite literally one of the best places ever. It's incredible. No! Wait, I'm confused. What does this mean? Um... What? What? I'm a little confused what happened there. I'm a little confused what happened. I survived, but... I know I know we have spirit shackles, but I'm kind of confused at why we survived. Like, I thought exiting the room would have killed me, but... Apparently not. Ooh. You made a mistake popping your tail up around these parts of town. Is, is this... Is this dude healing? What's going on with his health bar? There you go. You're dead. You're basic. I will most certainly take a ghostly buddy. You see? That is spicy as shit. Did you see how I perfectly executed that there? That, that was pretty impressive, you got to say. That was pretty impressive. One second, I need to pause. Okay, let's carry on. Okay, let's see if we can get a cracked key here. Also got a secret room here. Give me some soul hearts. Give me some health to rely on. I'll use the crack key here, because why the hell not? Cracked. Damn, the reason why not was because this wasn't the correct way. I don't think I need any more keys, game. Ah, there's pins everywhere. I love this pin mod, by the way. The custom, the, like, different pins. It's just... Adds a nice amount of flavor to the game. Ooh, I didn't consider this. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I was like, ooh, maybe a health upgrade, maybe some damage, maybe just a good item. No, 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 no. All of my dreams have been shattered by Tropicana. Your sadness sponsored by Tropicana. I'm sorry, Tropicana, don't hate me. I like your orange juice. You watch when I'm big and famous 10 years and uh, 10 years into the future and I've got a Tropicana sponsor. Someone's going to pull up this moment and say, look, he betrays the brand. And then they're going to disassociate with me. I'm going to be left destitute. Now, these are pretty unusual circumstances, but you know it'll happen. Oh, look, Penny. Look, Penny. And yeah. 
Eh. What did you do? I don't want to know, I don't think. Okay, these spider boys are a little annoying, but we can deal. You want my box of friends? No thank you, sir. No thank you whatsoever. Fire the barrage. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad. Mother should get reasonably wrecked in a reasonable amount of time here. We've only got one bomb. I was going to bomb her a bit, but it doesn't seem like the wisest idea anymore. I still can't believe that the, the little keeper dudes haven't dropped a single penny. Maybe I'm wrong that they do that. I have no idea, but maybe they don't do that anymore. Oh, God. It's hard to not get hit in. Compound Fracture is just a generally really laggy item when you're, when you're playing modded. In vanilla, it's fine, but playing modded, it tends to cause a lot of issues. There you go. We got him. Gotta check it out. Uh, excuse me? Okay. Lose a life, gain a buddy. I'm just taking it all. I'm going full risky right now. I've, I've got to check it. Mini Isaac, be free. Ah, what the hell. <laughs> I'm like, what's that thudding noise? And then I realize it's our little heart thing beating. Because for some reason... All of the, like, familiars and deliverance have, like, weird sound effects. Like, it's not a bad sound effect, it's just it's a little irritating. It's just the little tummy one that I remember is the one that's been, like, really annoying. Ooh, I don't, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know what you do, but I do not want to find out. Okay, probably won't get into second secret room yet, but... More money. Exactly what I need in the cathedral. Hey, there's our boss already. God, every time I see a, a hurling eternal enemy, I'm like, oh no. Also, that's a lot of eternal flies too. Look down for a damage up. Hell yeah. Right, so we have to kill this guy without taking damage, which I feel is not impossible, but not very likely. Just with the amount of time it takes to kill this guy. More so like dealing with the lag is the is the problem here. Yeah, I don't even know what hit me then. This is gonna be difficult. Oh, also now I don't have my box. I didn't even consider that possibility. Here's to hoping it doesn't matter too much. I've got a really itchy inner nurse right now. And it's it's really hampering my ability to play this game with full focus. I feel like once we get into this phase, we've got more of a chance. I'm okay at this phase. I'm not the best at it. I'm not going to say I'm not going to get hit, but I'm a little scared that we're moving around, moving him around so much, though. At least he's not eternal. There you go. We got him. It, it took a bit of doom, but we got him. And a half soul heart as a treat. Thank you. Okay. I don't know if this is a good idea, but I'll take quad shot. Fettered heart's great. Sulfuric acid's kind of meh. Killing an enemy grants a small damage up. Yeah, that's also pretty good. I did die there, apparently. Oh, 
Oh god. Please be able to push them back. These guys are going to be a soul heart though when they die. This has been a risky bisky run. Wait, they... Oh no, they, I was just going to say they didn't give me a soul heart. They did. I'm just dumb. You're all fettered now. Wait, where'd my soul heart go? What? The soul heart? The spirit shackle have to charge with soul hearts or something. But I don't know. Did I not know that? Because I definitely picked up a soul heart, and I no longer have a soul heart, and I definitely didn't get hit. Okay. Boss is definitely this way. I, I, well, I say definitely. Very highly likely to be this way. My lord. He tried to heal them all at once. Oh, God. I have literally no idea what this guy does. I'm just hoping to not find out. He did throw a lot more spikes there, but we got him. Black heart. We needed it. There's no way I don't get hit in this mess. Okay. Actually done okay here. I didn't get hit in that mess. You bastard. Not a single one of those rocks was a spike for it was a spike rock, you know what I meant. <laughs> a uh, tinted spike rock. Not a single heckin' one. Yeah, get back, get back. Fight him off. Looks like we're drawing to a close here. I'm gonna say this will be boss. Oh god. This guy could this guy could hit us pretty fucking hard. What are you doing with all those tears, my ladder? Okay, we got him. Did we get him? Oh, you bastard. You only get one shot, so make it count. Now nah, this is, we're not going to get him in one shot. At least he's not eternal, but with this lag, plus the homing shots that he fires and all that sort of good jazz, I think things are going to be a little precarious for a minute. You can see how little damage we've done to him so far. And I don't have any bombs to, like, calm calm down the health bar a little bit. That's normally the good way to uh, make him chill out somewhat. Yeah, I'm going to say there was no way I wasn't getting hit there. This is... There's a good chance this isn't possible. I'm going to stay optimistic, but I can't really see anything. The game is running at 18 FPS, which is just horrible. I don't know why Compound Fracture's so laggy, but every time I get it is. And we've still got just under half his health bar to go here. I'm just hoping the more I, the more shit I talk, the higher my chances. So I'm just going to keep talking shit and hope for the best. No, what hit me? I'm still spirit shackled. I got him. Okay, that worked. I don't know how, but it worked. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. What a nice little run there, and I'll see you guys in the next one.